Are you feeling better? There's a delegation here from Rome. They're waiting to see you. Eh. You're a fine one. You made yourself worse with all those figs. I never heard anything so ridiculous. I only came on this journey to look after you. And you won't let me or anyone else cook for you. It was very embarrassing, you know. People might think we were trying to poison you. I sent for Tiberius. Fortunately, he wasn't too far away. He'll be here soon. Well, I thought you might want to see him. And he'll do everything that has to be done. Hasn't he always? Of course, you two they haven't always seen eye to eye. But that hasn't been entirely his fault. You know that, don't you? You were always inclined to favor one over the other. I've often spoken to you about it. You made fish of one and fowl of the other so often that no one knew where he was or what he was. You should have listened to me more. You should have. You know that, don't you? I've been right more often than you have, you know. But because I was a woman, you pushed me into the background. Oh, yes. Yes, you did. And all I ever wanted was for you and for Rome. Nothing I ever did was for myself. Nothing. Only for you and for Rome. As the Claudian should. Oh, yes, my dear. I'm a Claudian. I think you are apt to forget that at times. But I never did. No. Never. Never.